that was like the shocking part to me. And so now I know going forward, Hey everybody, welcome back to the weekly life lessons with me, B. Scott. Um, if this is your first time here, hit that like button. You already know, push this video out to other dream chasers like yourself. Hit that subscribe button if you want to join a community of high frequency individuals where I'm just going to be sharing my life lessons every single week as I grow and develop as an individual. And I would love to hear your thoughts and what you're growing through or like if you could resonate with some of those things that I'm chatting about in the comments. And I just want to build a community of people who just all we just helping and growing together, okay? So, today's video is why you can't take your foot off the gas. Okay, and and, is, and I'm gonna tell you, this came to be because when the year ended last year, right? Like, I reflected on the year and I noticed that I was honestly only going at about 30%, okay? And I was truly bothered because as y'all know, life, years pass quick. And a lot of these opportunities that you got today, you won't have tomorrow. The same opportunities you have this year, you won't have next year. And it's just like, the more time you waste, like trying to put yourself in a position to win is just the more opportunities you lose. This is just a fact. And I know they say one door closes, another door opens. And I definitely believe that. But it's also, you got to hold yourself accountable for not putting yourself in a position to win. All right? Y'all got me. So that's why I was so upset at that year, at last year. And so I told myself this year, I was going to go crazy, okay? I was going to stay focused. I was going to stay locked in. I wasn't going to do no, no extra nonsense. Like I was like, focus. January, February, I went crazy, okay? And I just saw the growth. Even through like my social media channels, like I just saw the growth, I saw the focus, and I was like, bet. Um, I'm setting myself up for the model, and I did my first shoot um, with acting. I got, uh, ended up submitting to like a couple really big agencies. I'm just like, bet, like things is going good, things is going good. And with all that action leading to like a crazy momentum, Y'all know what I did. I turned around and started like falling back a little bit on my action and letting the momentum just carry me, okay? And let me tell y'all what done happened. The momentum was going up and now it's just like this. Right on back down. And I was in like shock. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I was just like, oh my God, like what's going on? Like, this is crazy. And then it hit me. You can never take your foot off the gas. When people say new levels, new devils, like this is what they mean. It was just like so shocking to see that right when I stopped like going extra hard with my action and like my intentionality towards making things happen and just kind of knowing and doing just enough to kind of do it. It just was crazy how everything just dropped. And I was just like, wow, like, it's it's insane to see how how like you can put in some work, but I'm also gonna hold myself accountable to say, seeing those results also must have put my headspace in a place where I was celebrating way too early. So I don't know if y'all also experienced that where not only do you take your foot off the gas because you have momentum, but you also like are celebrating too early. And I wasn't literally celebrating like partying and going out, but just in the sense of like feeling like, oh, you good now. You've done enough to win. And you really can't ever do enough to win. And it's like, that was like the shocking part to me. And so now I know going forward, y'all had to see me like, all this week, just restructuring my schedule, remaking it right. Because what I've learned is like, you got to create the perfect blend for yourself um, of making time for friendships, making time for yourself and chasing after your dreams. Okay. And in my case, you know, I also got a job. So it's like, I just, I got to create like this perfect timeline, which is why like, even with this channel, we, we uh, move, I moved to three videos a week because that gives me time to give y'all better quality videos with better edits. Um, that are stronger versus just pumping out content every single day for you to just like waste your time with you feel me and so man I just hope if anybody else is feeling like how I was where everything was going good and you just feel like things start falling off that man we just got to keep our foot on the gas okay we can't turn around and go backwards the day we do is the day we just fall off all right so if you enjoyed this video make sure you hit that like button hit that subscribe button join me on this journey comment your thoughts have you been in momentum and then you started to fall off like i would definitely love to hear about it and make sure you check out my next video on the power of budgeting if you want to get your finances in order for this year too